it's been a little while since I've done a video um, I've never done a video on the backyard units this is a pretty remarkable one I think this is a custom paint black and white uh, this is high heat paint so um, I've had a couple of those questions asking about the color spectrum I have about a um, 270 color option to uh, get these things painted up but these have the uh, custom 10 inch wheels golf cart wheels d-rings ball valve for draining our uh, our custom zero turning radius front end the pull handles beefed up I had a couple pull handle issues early in the beginning um, not having those handle issues anymore so we uh, we beefed it up made everything really nice and sturdy uh, this particular unit is the 60 inch single door uh, they come in 60 inch double door as well uh, we can also do 48s and 36s you've seen those the stack is 6x6 six six tube the firebox is fully insulated and that's where we'll start let's get this opened up uh, my intakes are very smooth let's start here my intakes are real smooth I use uh, stainless steel washers in between the intake and the door itself so if anything was to ever happen uh, all you do is you change out that bolt or change out that washer 2,000 pound latch here hold it down tight being fully insulated Oh, you get that you get that pillow on the inside door and then you get the uh, 2,000 degree insulation in between it's a quarter inch inner box 2,000 degree mineral wool wrapped in a 1 8 shell uh, pretty badass so I've had a couple questions about the rebar grate as well that is three quarter inch rebar grate rebar is a little harder than steel so um, it, it actually doesn't warp as bad um, so it lasts longer because it's hardened uh, that's why I decided to start using rebar it's not because it's cheaper it's not because really anything in particular it's just the fact that it's uh, a lot harder and it lasts through the fire a bunch so normally the handles are stainless steel this is stainless steel but it's painted black so uh, to go with the color scheme uh, I kind of boo-booed on this one it was supposed to have two temp cages I did one and then uh, he saw that and said hey where's my second gauge and I said shit well can't put it anywhere else so I went and went ahead and gave him three so that's where we are with that all of these come with latch downs hold them tight um, another important feature is the seals on the doors um, all these doors are laser cut damn near to perfection so everything seals up nice and tight you don't have any bad leakage uh, this is definitely one of my number one selling features when it comes to these units. Um, it's very important that uh, your unit seals upright, you know, so that's something that we take a lot of pride in. Counterbalance door, very easy to lift up. There's the inside there. All grates slide out and lock. All of them come equipped with tuning plates. You can get the bottom grate and the top grate, hear me out, and the top grate, the same temperature all the way around this thing by using tuning plates. You have people talk about tuning plates, how they're, how they're not needed, they're not necessary. You know, when it comes to these things and, and, and efficiency and cooking space, you want to be able to use every square inch of cooking space on these things as far as I'm concerned and the tuning plates allow you to cook your briskets cook your ribs not have to rotate and switch and flip and turn them around and all this other stuff everything is done in one spot um, and if if you like to slow smoke a brisket say far away from the direct heat you come all the way over here if you've got multiple briskets on here you could probably put eight brisket 16 briskets on this one smoker they're all going to cook at the exact same time with the bottom and the top grate that's an important feature as far as i'm concerned um, these are all removable so you can take this completely out uh, you can clean your your smoker uh, fairly easily the um the the gaskets on the inside you see we use the uh, the inner gasket flange there which 
is the extra seal on the inside to make these things seal up and cook the way they're supposed to. You've heard my testimonials, you've heard me talk about it. A split of a split, which means one log cut four ways, nine to ten inches long is all it takes for these things to run an hour and a half. So, again, one log, once you get your coal bed going, one log split four ways, a quarter of a split if you will, about nine to ten inches long, will last about an hour and fifteen, hour and twenty minutes in these things. So, um, that's pretty much it. They're simple, they're classy, they're efficient, top of the line quality, tail true temp gauges. The only moving parts that we have are the bolts. Everything else is welded. Everything else is fully welded. These things are tanks. They're beautiful. Hit me up. Let me know what y'all think. I got one coming up soon where the guy said you got free range to class it up, make it look different, make it look uh, like something they've never seen before. So that was a mistake. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go crazy on that one. All right. Thanks a lot, guys.